the man behind Good Vibes, Good Life. If you're here, it means that you're probably into the law of attraction, or at least you're familiar with it. And recently, I started reading Good Vibes, Good Life. I haven't read it fully, but I read enough to get a gist of what it is all about. The principle that the law of attraction can be significantly enhanced just by raising our vibrational frequency. This is too confusing, you say? Speak in simple terms? No worries. Here is an even more simplified version of it. Every single thing in the universe is made of atoms. Those atoms are always in movement or vibration. Now, guess what else vibrates? Our thoughts. Now, if you know anything about the law of attraction, it is a known fact that thoughts become things. Therefore, we use the law of attraction to bring forth things we desire in our life by using the power of our mind and thoughts. What this book brings to the table is a mean to considerably increase the frequency of our thoughts by adding emotions to our manifestation rituals. Positive emotion makes our thoughts vibrate at a higher frequency. Negative emotions lower our vibrational frequency and therefore prevents us from manifesting to the best of our ability. As I was reading, the writer would make small allusions to his personal life here and there. And from that, I figured out that the man was still young and he was a Londoner. And for some reason, which I believe is normal, I developed a keen interest in finding out who actually wrote this book. Unfortunately, the level of information I was seeking was not just one Google search away. What I was looking for was something closer to a biography, but the only thing that I found were kind of related to the book more than to the man behind it. I took that as a sign that I had to make a video about everything we know about the mysterious Vex King, or I like to call him King Vex. By the way, King Vex is an alias. That's not his name. Nobody actually knows his name except from his close relatives. Just from that, you can see that the man went to great lengths to protect his private life. And this is by no means an attempt to intrude his life, but more of an effort to understand the man better. Early childhood. Vex was born on April 13th, 1987 in Northampton, England. He is the youngest child of an Indian family of three. When he was only six months old, his father passed away, leaving Vex's mother to take care of the kids. Their situation was alright as Vex's mother had the backing of her family's business. However, things quickly took a turn for the worse when the family member who owned the business went bankrupt. When they eventually became homeless, Vex's family had to move from place to place. Those places included hostels, shelters, shared accommodations. During these rough times, the level of violence King Vex witnessed was something no five years old should experience. Even when at some point he was living at his uncle's house for a bit, he experienced a home invasion. Intruders held his mom and sisters hostage and beat up his uncle. He wanted to do something, but what could he actually do? What can a child do in this situation? Eventually, the consul gave them a house. Only problem, they were the only Asian family in the area. Guess what that means? Let's just say that the neighbors didn't really welcome them too well. Racist blurs, bullying, and even threats. By the age of 15, it would be fair to say that life hadn't shown its best side to Vex King, a glimpse of hope. You see, Vex had a passion for music. One day while attending a music industry event, he heard one of the speakers mention a book that changed his life and many of the people attending vouch for it. Think and Grow Rich. The discovery of this book marked the birth of a new Vex King, one that would not accept his current condition, 
but take charge of his own destiny, the world of music. From his early teenage years, Vex was into music, especially hip-hop. From the age of 15, he was dabbling in production. While studying, he took a degree in business information system. He then worked as a system analyst for some time. Then he left that career to get in music production under the alias Vex Music. He then founded his record label, Fearless Entertainment. Vex worked with artists from both the UK and the US. Some of the most famous ones include Kelly Rowland, Rick Ross, Neil for the US artist. As of the UK, Tiny Tampa, Reg32, and Big Nasty coaching. Alas, Vex had become king. He had manifested his purpose and was living in it. Little did he know that a new purpose would reveal itself to him. The work he was doing in the music industry put him in contact with all sorts of high profile personalities and many would ask him for life advice. The life advice would then turn into full one-on-one -on -one sessions. And then the session will turn into coaching sessions. And then the people would recommend Vex to their friends and business partners. And before he realized, he had transitioned into full-time coaching. Social media fame. Vex had become a king in the coaching space. One day, he decided to share some of his life advice online. The response was unreal. His social media following just skyrocketed. Being the private cat that we know him to be, most of his posts would consist of quotes with compelling captions. Good vibes only. Now that the king has such an online influence, people would often message him to ask for advice or to just tell him about their problems. However, despite the fact that he wanted to help everyone individually, it was impossible. But what if you could create a guide that anyone could apply to their current circumstance and that will help them manifest the good life? In 2018, Vex got married to Koshal, who is the most popular Asian beauty YouTube channel. He said that on their honeymoon, they had a beautiful bonding experience over the fact that they both grew up without a father. But that day, Vex felt like his father was there. In the same year, he published Good Vibes, Good Life. So yeah guys, that was the life of Vex King. I hope you enjoyed it, King Vex. Also, go watch my other videos, they're awesome, trust me. Make sure you like, subscribe and share.